<laughs> How did you get what? into the character? <laughs> um, <laughs> once I found out I was playing a lizard with comfort, I literally went on YouTube and I looked up videos of lizards and I sat in the mirror and I mimicked what I saw. <laughs> So that was that, <laughs> and hopefully it worked. I mean, I guess I'll see. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's what I did to prepare myself. I mean, Comfort definitely helped me in the whole process. She's amazing. She's such a good performer, so I thought that I, I mean, it just made me want to work harder and step up. So, I mean, it was awesome. I, we were just in the back like this the whole time. We just twitching. Just must twitch, think lizard, and that's it. Think groovy lizard. And that's how we got it. And then I, you know, we just had to pump ourselves up. You know, just make sure we stay character. Make sure we didn't go overboard in character, but still stay hip hop. So it was a, it was difficult at first. It, you know, it's always difficult at first. This is not his genre. You know, it's not his thing. Um, so I'm used to doing this a lot. So I was able to just pull him through step by step. You know, so we can work together. Do your little. <laughs> Like, what is that? Did they, like, move their heads okay, really bye. fast? <laughs> okay. They move their heads really fast. <laughs> um, you know, I just really love, like, old-school movie musicals. I love the dream sequences and the dream ballets that Gene Kelly used to do, like, in Singing in the Rain. And, and it would just kind of get taken out of reality, and they would just dance. And usually I'm very story-driven with my pieces. And when I found out that I had Mackenzie and Jacob, who are technical beyond belief, and great, you know, great performers as well. I figured I didn't need all that this week, and I would just let them dance. And I used every second of my time to just show off their ability. And I, I can't wait to watch it back. It was really happy. I thought it looked beautiful. I thought we lit it really well, and the costumes and all that came together. So I, I was, I was super, super thrilled with it. Rar? Um, <laughs> Rar? <laughs> I mean, it was so much fun. Um, it was nice to have my hair down. Uh, that helped, I think, the whole whipping of the hair, the dress, I, I mean... Just the red on red. Red on red, Ella Fitzgerald singing Too Darn Hot. I mean, how do you not get into character with that? Um, it was so much fun. Such a fun routine and an amazing routine to go out with. I feel like we both um, feel so happy with our performances tonight, going out on a good note. Um, I'm so proud of both of us. Well, it, it does get tougher and tougher, but, you know, we are at the end of the day a dance competition. There's only going to be one winner, uh, and, and we're just in the process of knocking people out along the way now. I, I'm just sorry that it was Mackenzie that went tonight, uh, but at the same time, I'd have been sorry if it had been Jenna that had gone tonight. Oh, my gosh. I mean, how just so humbled and, like, just proud, proud of myself, honestly. I'm proud of myself, and... I can't believe that he said something like that. It's just incredible. can't believe it. We were unanimous with the boys, and we all said we wanted to keep Tucker. Uh, uh, but it's next week's going to be tough again, and the week after that's going to be even tougher. <laughs> A solid 15-0 to zero vote. Shut up. Uh, that was okay. I mean, Tucker, <laughs> Tucker's dance was seriously beyond beautiful. I mean, it had everyone in tears. I mean, so, I mean, I don't even know how to compete with that. that was, it was just beyond beautiful. He definitely deserved to say... So it's okay. I mean, that's the nature of the show. Two people have to go home, but now what? We get to rest. We get a few weeks to see our friends and family, we'll be hang out before finale. they all go to college. We'll be back. Yep. We got tour. tour. It's just the beginning for yeah. us.